Marzi with the 20. Makayev didn't make weight and Volk won the fight. I can't I can't care about the the um, these little uh, these guys, these hairy little guys. Mm -hmm. You know uh, Khabib? I've heard the name. The tre the trend now, the thing, the meta. First of all, First of all, the meta, the UFC meta for a while was leg kicks. Mm -hmm. Can you imagine a grown, gro two grown men kicking each other in the shins like a fucking little girl school fight? Yeah. Like a f middle school little girls kicking each other in the, sh in the shins? And when, I was in, when I was a kid, there was this girl, Crystal Hubs, and Crystal Hubs, they called her the shinner because she would go around kicking people in the shins. <laughs> That's, that's the UFC meta. Oh, big tough guys. These are the toughest guys in the world, Joe Rogan. These guys are so tough. They're so tough. They kick each other in the shins for 15 minutes. Oh, my God. And then, now it's like these guys are coming in um, who have, they're the corniest guys ever. Like Kam, Kamzat Chemaev. He's like, whoa, whoa, yeah. I'm going to kill everybody. Like the most, the most cringe soccer player, European soccer players. They, the, like the Vodafone, their little sponsors. Like they have like companies that don't exist, like Vodafone and Opal. And Vodafone. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like shouting out their sponsors when they get a goal. It's, it's demoralizing behavior. I think it's like uh, it's the European equivalent of what they do in the NFL, which is the you know, making these guys wear high heels for the the draft thing and dancing dancing around like little fruity fruity booties. Um, so, is that why you left the NFL? Yeah, well, that's one of the reasons why I got out of the NFL. Yeah. Um, I got a bunch here. I got but hit. these these Arab the, dude, I, the UFC, these Arab guys, I just can't make myself care. It, w it wouldn't matter if he was the str if he was the best fighter in the fucking entire galaxy and he could fight a robot that was made of titanium and he could destroy a tank with one. I, I wouldn't care. If it's an Arab guy with a beard, who's like, "Come here, brother! I show you how I can wrestle you." I can't. I can't make myself care about someone like that. I like the. I like Pride Fight Championships. I like um, Genki Sudo. I like the entrances. I like the the pageantry. I like the. Uh, I like Crow Cop. I like the crazy outfits. I don't care about some Arab. Like I don't care. I don't care if it's if there's like. Listen, if you told me that there's some. Guatemalan guy behind Stop and Shop right now, yeah. and he's got the biggest biceps, and he can crush a pineapple. I just don't care. <laughs> I don't care about some little hairy guy that's Muslim. I don't care if it's if if the, if there was a, if the best basketball player, if the best like whatever, if there was a guy who was like he could slam dunk a basketball and he could row a boat ten miles and he could do he could climb to the top of the world and he was the best F one. He was like the ultimate athlete. If he was Muslim and had a beard, I wouldn't care. Good for him. Good on him. Have fun. Keep going. Okay, go kick guys in the legs. But I don't care if he's mu if he's Muslim. If he's like Allah number one, I pray to Allah. I fucking don't want to watch that. I don't want to see that on any video screen. I don't want to hear that. I don't want to. Uh, you know, the only time I want to see people praying to Allah is if I crawl in the back of a box truck and there's a guy <laughs> praying with a stack of carpets. Oh, people hated that. Just fucking suck it.